if you are having one of these errors, follow me. The first thing you need to do is open your favorite browser and search for msvcp100.dll. You can choose any result you want. Let's choose the first one. This video is not sponsored, but I'll put the link in the description. You can see if you download option based on the computer architecture and version. If you don't know your computer architecture and version, click on start and search for system information. Here you can see my version and it is 64 bit. So in this case, I'll be downloading the first one. The download will be started. You can read this page. As the download completes, hit open. Inside the downloaded GIF, we can see the DLL file in it. In order to move the DLL, you need to first open this PC, then local LXC, Windows, and find a folder named System32. There it is. Then click on the downloaded GIF, drag the DLL file, and drop. Click on Continue to give administrator access. This is the summary of the process. If you are 64 bit users, open this PC, Windows, and find a folder name syswow64. And similarly, drag the DLL and drop. Click on continue to give administrator access once again. And finally, restart your computer. This is the summary of the process. In some special cases, if there are two lockers, you need to go to Microsoft and install Microsoft Visual Studio and Microsoft DirectX. This is a very easy installation, you won't have any problems. And do not forget to like and subscribe.